The Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, is working on a tightrope and the successful conduct of the 2019 elections is at stake. The budget for the conduct of the coming general election, which is less than 200 days away, is hanging. In the middle of July 2018, President Muhammad Buhari wrote a letter to the two chambers of the parliament requesting a speedy approval of a supplementary budget of 242.45 billion naira expenses for the polls. To ensure that adequate arrangements are made for free and fair elections, it has become necessary to appropriate funds to enable the relevant agencies to commence preparations. INEC and the security agencies have accordingly, accordingly recently submitted their request. These have been subjected to usual budget evaluation. The aggregate cost of the election is estimated at $242,445,322,000 600. But days after the letter was read, the issues of party politics and alleged victimization of the Senate leadership came up. Thereafter, the National Assembly proceeded on a recess. Aside the debate over the timing of the request, another area of contention is the president asking the National Assembly to make a violent of the total sum on the 578.31 billion naira the lawmakers imputed into the 2018 budget as constituency projects. Beyond legislative matters, the lawmakers are divided across party lines. The defections has further polarized the assembly, and forming a quorum on reconvening the assembly is now more difficult as suspicion grows among the lawmakers. As the battle for supremacy continues, time is running out. The election budget is stuck in the gridlock of politics. The commission and other agencies of government may be forced to look for other sources of funding to take care of its procurements, which must start months before the election day, or risk the possibility of shoddy preparation ahead of the crucial election year.